back to the Nystrom hit on Latang as we welcome Jeremy Roenick Look what to the, the party. Yes. In, huh? Look at this. And there's yeah. a reason Mr. JR opinion. is Mr. here because, opinion, right? because there's like been Mr. a difference opinion. of opinion, hasn't there? Yeah. Go ahead, boys. And, and, and believe me, I'm really surprised there's a difference of opinion, especially with the way you played the game. Well, let's to, to, do a little history first before we get into it. Let's you agree history. there's a concussion issue, correct? Oh, there's no question. 1,100, according to CBC no website. I've had, the, I've had my share on them. And here are some of the names of the guys that have been suffering from concussions just this year alone. I mean, Sidney Crosby still hasn't come back. You're looking at Nick Backstrom doesn't make the list because he hasn't been out long enough to be there. And there's just a ton of them. I mean, Mark Stahl was lucky to get back into the lineup. These are big-time players, and this is why the rules were changed, because these concussions became so so deadly. There's a blindside hit. That was a clean hit. That At the time, that was a clean hit. This is Cook on Savard. Savard is now basically retired. He's no longer going to be able to play. This is Sidney Crosby. An accident. Most people agree that was an accident, but a concussion. So they changed the rule to say if you target the head, you should be penalized. I say you can get the puck there. I say he shows no courage whatsoever by not going after the puck. I think he targets he the guy's the head. He, he, he can't he had, get the puck. He, he was reaching to that, grab the puck. But his head puck. wasn't even hit. He, his head wasn't even hit. He's out with a concussion. He's he goes out even, for the game. Not, his head was You're not even hit. You're telling me he didn't hit his head. He did not hit his head. Can I we was show in the back room. again, please, I'm Mark I'm in the back room. I saw from every angle. I saw every angle. I saw the slow-mo. I saw the stop. You don't. I think he snapped his head. It, did, it doesn't matter if he snapped his head. He hits head. him in the chest. And, of course, when you hit him in the chest, just, his head is going to snap. Just take a look and watch how this... And he also, snaps his let's chin just, on let's, the side. Let's, let's take hitting out of hockey, way. Mike. Let's Classic take hitting way. out of hockey. That oh, is, my, that is, that is Nystrom, who is a, you know, a hard-hitting you, you player. You tell me you didn't see his head snap. You didn't see his head go like that. That's because he hit him in the chest. If I hit you in the chest, your head is going to go back. If you hit him just like hit Crosby like that, If I hit you in the chest, your head is going to snap, too. JR, the point is he's in a vulnerable position. And he put himself... In a vulnerable he put position. Himself, I understand he, put he himself reached. In a, hey, and, listen, and, and, I love Latang as much as anybody else. He's one of my favorite players. But you have to learn how to take a hit correctly. He put himself in a vulnerable position. He got hit by a player who was a physical player. And he should have gone up at the boards and cushioned the hit, he take could, a hit to make the play. By the way, if I'm Dan Bosma, I'm going to tell Pierre Maguire to go stick that microphone someplace else because I would not be answering that question when my best player, one of my best players lying on the ice and going to be out of it. Another story It was a correct aside, answer, though. But I'm it telling you. It was a JR, correct answer. The whole he was point very... is we have to change the way the guys look at it. You're not supposed to try to decapitate the player well, then, who's got he, the puck. What you want to do is get the puck. Elbow didn't we're come changing, up. It was a solid body we're check. changing the mindset. What the happens? guy that hits what is happens? now responsible for the contact. What happens? What happens if 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 Nystrom does not hit Latang, he jumps by him, and they go back and score another he goal. Had, he had well, a, actually had a 50-50 chance on that he puck. He didn't have a 50-50 and, chance. And I'm talking about going in there now. We talked about bear hugs. He doesn't right have there. A, he, he knows he's not going to get the puck The puck is right barely there. moving, and it's moving in his direction. And even if he doesn't, he's, all he has to do is slide into him here. I'm talking about changing the player's mindset. Jonesy, help me out here. Well, no, I, I do agree with Mike on that aspect. He needs I don't help. think this he is a, a suspendable play, though. What, what should be, in my opinion, it should be a suspendable play. You remember back to last year, uh, the big hit in the playoffs, Rafi Torres on Brent Seabrook. Clearly, Torres was, is a hit-first player, but he makes no attempt to get the puck. Here's the hit. There's Seabrook. He has no idea that Rafi Torres is coming. Watch the puck. He leaves it to throw the check. Makes no attempt to look for the puck. And it's the exact same thing that happens tonight. Nystrom had the opportunity to get the puck. That mindset is the issue. The hits to the head clearly are a major issue in hockey and in all major sports. That's the thing that I have a problem with. That's what we have to continue to try right. to get to and remove from the game. Unfortunately, on both you guys, his head wasn't hit. His chin might have been grazed, but his head was not hit. The shoulder and the elbow. Elbow, hit the chest. I saw it on five or six different plays, different we watched angles. It several times. His he head didn't get him, hit. He clipped him with his shoulder on the head right here. Whether it's targeted or not is not for me to say. I'm not in his head. But he didn't go in with the intention of playing the puck. He Brendan, saw Brendan a vulnerable Shanahan player. Is see this play and, 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 and he uh, hit him. And the, 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 the most contact that was hit is to the chest. And that's what's going to be seen. And you know what? We should just take hot, hitting out of hockey. Oh, right, stop. Mike? 
like for that, Jr. I'm not just going. We should take it. Take it. You're accusing me of being soft. I'm accusing you of making a marshmallow look firm. You're getting soft. You're getting soft. This has been great. I got to jump in. You're getting soft. Don't let the door hit you on the way out. You're getting soft. You've been a good. The last time you're on. If I get hit in the head, are you going to give that a major penalty too? Take a hike. Go see Coach Keenan out there. We're done. This comes from a guy who, you know, Mr. Tough Guy. Out the door.